Welcome to Famous Fortunes. I hope you are well. Prince Charles has been named and shamed according to a new book. Have you seen this? He has been named as uh, someone who didn't make the exact comment. This is this is my understanding. He didn't. He's been named as someone who didn't make the exact comment referenced in the Oprah interview, but he made one just like it. So. Wrap your heads around that one. Not the same exact comment, but it was exactly similar in effect. Uh, I don't know fully how to wrap my head around that. But in any event, let's look into this today. What is going on here? Is this... Are we going to get a naming and shaming? Let's 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 start. Are uh, Meghan and Harry going to name and shame the... The uh, the perpetrator, let's say. The perpetrator of the heinous crime. Let's figure it out today. Let's get into it. If you have a question for a future video, let it be known in the comments. If you'd like to support the channel, go ahead and join Team Famous Fortunes. Is uh, Meghan and Harry going to name and shame the perpetrator? Harry said he'd never tell. Let's find out. Let's find out. Cards are hot. What do we have? Looking for a quick spread here. The Sun, King of Cups, High Priestess, Knight of Cups, Four of Wands, Ace of Swords. Oh, this is okay. Strange spread. I'll tell you why. You want to know why? I'll tell you. The Sun looks like it's getting it. It's getting it out there. It's airing the dirty laundry, so to speak, in this. In this context, but the high priestess is remaining quite, you know, lips are sealed. So I'm seeing it's it's very hard to say actually because you you were getting these very very different energies. Now we do have a king of cups and a knight of cups and a four of wands. So I wonder just before we, I want to look into who exactly had these comments actually been made and who made them. But there may be there may be two people involved here. Let's say father and son of the of the royals. Now, who could that be? Who could it be? It might. I'm not saying it might not be the key, like the main royals, the line of succession royals. You know, up the top of the list, perhaps it may not be. We're gonna find out if we can. We're gonna find out. And I don't want to finish this episode until, until we know. So, so let's uh, let's uh, interesting information here. Coming to light, but then also keeping it a secret. So I don't, I don't know what to make of that. I mean, what do you... <laughs> oh, I'm just reading the cards. I don't know what to make of that. It's, it's kind of what he's done. So let's ask now, was this actually said? Yep, not, not necessarily misconstrued. Let's ask, was it actually said in the beginning? In the very beginning, was this said? Was such a comment made? Cards are hot. Three of Cups. King of Wands. King of Wands. Oh boy. So we've had two kings. Ooh, the devil. Oh boy. The plot's thickening today. Queen of Pentacles. Seven of Wands. Ace of Swords. Devil. Devil. Jar. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, was the comment actually made? The devil. Now we're getting here. Now it's the plot is thickening, that's for sure. So let's get some uh, remuneration for the devil's swear jar. Okay, devil swear jar has been paid. And the jar fell over. Okay, devil swear jar has been paid. Was the comment made? Look, if the comment was made, then I'm going to go ahead and say some... If the comment was made, then it was absolutely twisted here with the devil. It's it's been it's been misconstrued to the max with the devil. And rem and don't forget the devil card here is front and center cornerstone card here.
You know, Three of Cups, it, to me, this looks like a situation where a celebration's happening, literally. A celebration's happening, everyone's happy, uh, you know, raising their glasses, having a good time. And that's, it looks to me, I wonder if that, that was the circumstances in which the comment was made, you know. Because it, look, just for, just for a moment, there would exist in all possibility a, there is a chance that a comment like that may be made with the best of intentions, right? If there's not, no one can say that there's absolutely 0% chance that a comment like that could be made with the best of intentions. No one can say that because there would exist in all possibility a time where a comment like that could be made with the best of intentions. Over a celebration, perhaps, you know, celebratory uh, drinks, baby uh, baby news drinks, or, or what have you. Uh, that's kind of what I'm seeing here on the cards. Uh, so with that, with that, you know, little thought experiment, why do we have a devil card? I don't think this has been completely fabricated. But it's been, I think, this is heavy manipulation. Heavy, hardcore manipulation. Next level. Next level. Now, King of Wands is typically Prince William. I just want to throw that out there. Before we had the uh, King of Cups... Which I will say, and the Knight of Cups, I did say Father and Son. The King of Cups, at one time, there was a time on Famous Fortunes when the King of Cups was Prince Charles. If you recall that time, if you've been watching Famous Fortunes, you will remember that perhaps that Prince Charles at one time did come up as a very sensitive, kind man. Nowadays, we see him more as the King of Swords. Uh, or the emperor, perhaps someone who, let's just say, is a little bit more, uh, a little bit more, mm, how can I say this, on the offensive, I think, <laughs> let's let's say that. All right, in any event, uh, I just want to make those points known as we progress through these readings. Queen of Pentacles, there is, there's a woman here. There's a woman here. There's a woman. The devil, the queen of pentacles. I'd say this is the birth. Uh, the birth giver. <laughs> Maybe I wouldn't say it's the birth giver. Maybe I would. Maybe it's the birth mother. Maybe it's not. Who knows? Who knows? I mean, can you touch your toes? Let's let's say that. Can you... Uh, can you... <laughs> can you put your feet together and squat down nine months pregnant? <laughs> Can you do that? Can you do that? If you've if you've been able if you have been able if you've been blessed to birth a child, were you able to squat straight down and straight up again? Heavily pregnant. Let it be known in the comments. Uh, let it be known. Let it be known. But that's another topic for another time. Perhaps perhaps we're not going to cover that on this channel. I think that's probably on the cards. In any event, <laughs> it's just ridiculous. In any event. <laughs> In any event. In any event. Right, where are we? Okay, so the devil. Uh, heavy manipulation. Hardcore. Out of context. Uh, malicious manipulation. That's what I'm seeing on the cards. What else do you want me to say? It's what I'm seeing. It's what I'm seeing. We already paid the devil jar, all right? We already paid the devil jar. Okay, we paid our dues. Who, who or whom made the original comment? Actually, before we do this, before we do this, was the comment made innocently or maliciously? The original comment. Let's get a lock on that and then we're going to look at who. Was the comment made maliciously or with good intentions? Cards are hot. Before I uh, pull these cards, 
I was at a Psyche Expo once and, uh, you know, you walk around and there was this lady handing out cards and she goes, oh, I'll pick a card, you know, one's for you. So she went to hand me the cards and half the deck fell, 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 uh, fell on the floor and perhaps even more than half the deck, maybe three quarters of the deck fell on the floor. And she picked the she picked the cards up and she goes, oh, they must all be meant for you then. <laughs> I was like, thanks. <laughs> <For reading. laughs> Let's have a look. Six of Pentacles, Eight of Swords, Death, Ace of Wands, Five of Wands, Underlying Energy, The Magician. Magician and Death, hey? I don't think the comment was made. <laughs> I actually, uh, full disclosure, full disclosure, uh, I had a look at this question before this episode, okay? And I'm actually, I'm getting very similar cards and my thoughts were, I don't think the, <laughs> I don't think the comment was made then and the same cards are coming up now, Death and the Magician, and I don't think the comment was actually made. So... That's what I actually think's happened here. I don't think there has been a comment. I don't think so. I don't think so. Uh, the magician, it, it's the underlying energy. It's being made to sort of look like something that it is not. It is not. I don't even think, I think if we were to hear what the original comment was, say, for example, if there's a recording, a voice recording of it or whatever it is, I think it'd be like, how did it end up on Oprah? That's where we would be at. It would be just like, what? 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 That's how we would be, to be honest with you. I think that's... I, I, I don't think there's a comment here. Uh, there's no... There is no... Um, I don't see malintent here. I think there's been... If anything, a big, fat misunderstanding here. Five of Wands. I don't even... I and, and when I say misunderstanding, I don't even think that there was a comment made here in a in a way that this, this is not a thing. This is not a thing. And we're about to ask who's made the comment. We are going to ask that. Don't, don't you worry. We are going to ask that. But what I'm seeing here is there is nowhere close to a comment made that that's what said was made. Does that make sense? <laughs> Does that make sense? It didn't happen. It did not happen the way it was said to have happened. And that's what happens when you play Montecito Whispers, right? <laughs> Montecito Whispers. Oh, Montecito Whispers. Good stuff. Okay. I will never, I let's, before we get into this, let's just remember, I will never say who said the comment because I don't think anyone said it, my man. <laughs> anyway, maybe they did. Maybe they did. Maybe they did. Maybe they did. Let's get into it. Who's made the comment? Who or whom? We're going to ask that question now. We are going to ask the question. So buckle your seatbelts. Get ready. We're going to find some answers here. I think, we're, I think we've got a good shot at finding an answer. I, I have that feeling that the future looks good for finding an answer here. So let that be known. Let it be known. Who do you think made the comment? Pause the video. Let us know. We'll see. We'll see. I don't even know. I don't even want to... Uh, look, we did see some indications in the first couple of spreads. Perhaps. Look at all these cards. They're all meant to be, hey? Maybe. Maybe. Empress. Oh, Empress. Okay, maybe that is. Maybe that is. <laughs> Let's find out. Let's find out. Empress and the Devil. Right. Who made the comment... Don't tell me, don't tell me it was, uh, they did say it wasn't the queen though, I think, I think it's, uh, I think they did say that, so. Go 
Cards are hot. Who is the culprit? Three of Swords. The Star. The High Row Fant. King of Pentacles, Page of Cups, Underlying Energy, Three of Wands, Member of the Royal Family, King of Pentacles, Page of Cups, Made About the Page, What is our member of the Royals? I think this might have been discussed at the Royal family level. Okay. It may have been discussed, you know, a member of the three of cups, a group celebration, that type of thing at an event, at an event, at a Royal event. It happened at a Royal event. It was a three of cups event. It was a gathering, a celebration, a, you know, a chinking of cups, you know, that type of thing. King of Pentacles. So it's a man. A man has made this comment. A man has made this comment. And we did see the King of Cups, King of Pentacles. Uh, here, King of Cups before. We did see a King of Wands as well. We did see a sort of father and son type of a thing. I wonder if the comments... You know, actually, when I when I first saw the Oprah interview back in the back in the the before time, in the long, long ago, I immediately when Harry said it, I saw Prince Charles talking to Prince William. That's that's what I saw. So I saw I saw that happening, and I saw Harry going back to tell Meghan at some stage, and uh, then at that point. It, uh, it, it became, it became something that it perhaps, uh, shouldn't have been. Uh, I think that's probably from these cards. I think it's probably the most likely thing that's happened here as well. Now, don't forget the devil. Okay. Don't forget. How can you forget? We're all, we're all traumatized by the devil. Okay. That's, <laughs> that's certainly, uh, it certainly how it appears to be. Certainly how it appears to be. Even, even though I don't think the comment was anywhere near what it was reported to be, I think it's so different to what it was reported to be, I don't think it would even be recognisable. So let that be known. Let that be known. Quite something. Oh boy. Oh boy. What can what can you say? What can you say? What can you say? King of Pentacles. One big fat nothing burger, really. That's what I'm seeing on the cards. Oh boy. Oh boy. It's time for a it's time for a quick bonus reading, I feel. It's time for a quick bonus reading. Does Harry regret uh, mentioning that on the Oprah interview? In fact, let's do a uh, fork. Let's get forked here. Harry on the left, Megan on the right. Do they regret pulling, uh, or mentioning that, let's say, pulling that out of a hat? Let's, let's ask. Do there any regrets there? Any regrets? Also, too, what's with the love of squatting? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. If anyone can answer that, then let it be known in the comments. It seems to be kind of a mystery. It's a it's a, it's a mysterious uh, thing. I, I just don't quite understand the fascination with it. Ten of Pentacles. I have Harry here. Hermit. King of Cups. Ten of Swords. Uh, ten of uh, Wands. The Star. King of Pentacles. Interesting. 
Oh, it's it's definitely Prince Charles. <laughs> it's definitely Prince Charles. Are you Harry absolutely regrets it because it ended effectively the relationship with his father. There you go. What more can I say? A little bonus reading there. And it made things extremely difficult for Megan. It made things very, very difficult. It's now a burden she has to carry that that whole that whole accusation is now a burden she has to carry. And again, we're seeing the King of Pentacles, King of Cups. The two, this is confirmation. It's Prince Charles. Okay, poor Prince Charles. He has been accused. I don't even think when we saw the death card, we saw the death card in this episode. Only, you know, 20 minutes before the episode, I saw the death card where I asked the exact same question. So I actually think there might be footage of that somewhere to prove it if, you, if you'd like to see it. I'm sure I could... I'm sure I can dial that up. Uh, I'm pretty sure there's footage of that. But in any event, is there footage of that? Maybe. Maybe I took a photo. Mm. Yeah. He's seriously, it's seriously determined. Harry ended his relationship with his father. Mm. That was the end of it. That was the exact moment that it, uh, that it was over. And that was exact moment that Megan brought this uh, tremendous burden upon herself. So what do you think about all of this? Let it be known in the comments. Now, bear in mind, I'm a humble tarot reader and I'm just reading what I see on the cards and through experience and all the rest of it. Could, could be completely wrong. And I'm just reading cards. Who would you, why would you take that seriously? So <laughs> in any event... In any event, with all that said, let it be known. I'll see you in the comment section. Let's talk about this. What do you think? I'll see you there.